Here's a really cool number that I want to show you guys. So a polydivisible number is a number that the first digit is divisible by one, the first two digits are divisible by two, the first three divisible by three, so on and so forth. Now, there is only one rule to polydivisible numbers, and that is that the first digit cannot be zero. So let's get into a quick example. So in base four, which basically says how many digits are in it, so zero, one, two, and three would be base four, a polydivisible number in base four is 321, which doesn't start with zero. The first digit, three, is divisible by one. The first two digits, 32, are divisible by two. And the first three digits, 321, are divisible by three. Let's move on to base 10, which is the most common, but also one of the most complicated for polydivisible numbers. So base 10 has the digits zero through nine, which is all of the digits. This number is pretty crazy. Drum roll, please. 381,654,729. So let's break it down real quick. Three is divisible by one, 38 is divisible by two, and 381 is divisible by three. Now, so on and so forth, you know, like 381,654,729 is indeed divisible by nine. So polydivisible numbers are also super insane, not just because it's a really cool pattern, but also because they are finite. There are only a few polydivisible numbers possible in the universe. So that's pretty cool, because most things in math are infinite like pi or the Fibonacci sequence. So this is pretty cool that it's finite and there are only a few. So polydivisible numbers overall are insane.